to give you guys my top tip for staying on track with weight loss or health in general when you're on vacation. And this is probably not what you're expecting. Actually, I'm going to give you two tips, one little bonus one. So the first one is watch that sentence that we always say. And that sentence is, but I'm on vacation, but I'm traveling, but I'm not home. That sentence right there can literally make or break us. I noticed myself saying that forever ago and I don't say it anymore. Truth is, it's not true most of the time. We want our vacation to be fun. We want to feel good before, during, and after. And when we are saying, but I'm on vacation, so I just want to eat all that, all that the food that's in front of me and overeat all of it, we usually don't mean it. We're just using that as a reason, as an excuse, because it's comfortable. It's a habit for us to not make a change. So I, my, my tip would be to question that. Do you really want to keep saying that? And do you want to mean it in the way that you have been meaning? I know that I didn't, and I know it's made a world of difference for me when I go on these trips. Me now being on vacation, the definition of that when it comes to my eating and my habits is completely different than it used to be 10 years ago. So I would encourage you to think about what do you want like the definition of that to be for you. For me, it's just... I'm having fun, I'm gonna maintain some of my habits and then I'm going to intentionally indulge in some other areas. I might not go to the gym, but I'm still gonna move my body and I'm not gonna overeat and I'm still gonna get in some foods and, and fruits and vegetables and things that make me feel good in the day to day. Second tip, kind of the little one that I'll leave you with too is just don't ever plan on eating breakfast at an airport. I was thinking about this yesterday because I, I was used to travel a good amount for work. And like any time that I did not bring something with me to the airport for breakfast, I was so mad about it. Because if you try and go and have breakfast at an airport, you're going to be spending like at least $10. And you are getting very mediocre food most of the time. There are some airports that are definitely an exception. But you are gonna, it's going to be so much easier to find things like uh, pastries and donuts and waffles and pancakes and croissants and all of that. And if you want that, that's totally fine. Most of the time, that's not what I want, especially not in the airport, especially not on the way home. So my tip is always bring snacks with you that you can eat as like a breakfast. And at the beginning, I definitely would have, and my excuse would have been, well, I had nothing else to eat. While I was hungry, I had to eat. So always pack something with you that you could at least have for breakfast in the airport.